Hello, this is your National Weather Service. Here is your Thursday weekly weather briefing for North Central and Southwest Montana. Our overall warm weather will persist through the weekend, though in generally it will be only near to a bit above normal for most areas. Temperatures trend back toward normal everywhere next week. We can expect overall increasing humidity across the area, which may help to temper concerns on some fire activity. However, the increased humidity will be accompanied by an increased chance for showers and thunderstorms. So, new lightning fire starts and gusty winds will remain a concern in the fire weather world. The best chance for showers and thunderstorms will generally be over southwest Montana through the next few days, but spread northward from Sunday onward. Some of the storms, especially on Sunday and Monday, could put down some heavier rain, which may present a low probability but high impact risk for flash flooding, especially around any recent burn scars. Here's a graphical depiction of the expected weather over the next week and the potential impact levels associated with any such event. We'll dive into more details in the coming slides. It will remain near to a bit warmer than normal over the next few days, with highs in southwest Montana generally in the mid 80s to around 90. And for central and northern areas, Highs will mainly be in the upper 80s to mid 90s. This map shows the Saturday forecast highs, but you can expect fairly similar temperatures from today through Sunday. Heading into next week, increased cloud cover and precipitation chances will likely help to temper highs back closer to normal from Monday onward. The best chances for showers and thunderstorms today will definitely be over southwest Montana up through central Montana mountain ranges. However, some isolated showers and thunderstorms may sneak out into the north central plains from later this morning into the evening hours. Regardless, no organized severe thunderstorm activity is expected today, though any thunderstorms could produce an erratic and gusty outflow wind. Shower and thunderstorm chances on Friday and Saturday will diminish and generally be confined to southwest Montana. Less moisture will be available for any storms to work with on those days, so the potential for isolated dry thunderstorm activity which will be accompanied by the risk for lightning fire starts and strong outflow winds could play havoc with fire activity or any of the fires that are currently burning across this area. As said before, the best rainfall chances for Thursday through Saturday will mostly be kind to southwest Montana. However, increasing precipitation chances will build into north central Montana from Sunday through Tuesday. There appears to be a risk for slow moving showers and thunderstorms on Sunday and Monday in particular which could result in some flash flooding concerns, especially in steep terrain and around any recent burn scars. On this slide we show the latest forecast probabilities for areas to see over a half inch of rainfall in a 24 hour period. With Sunday on the left and Monday on the right there's a chance for slow moving showers and thunderstorms both days but the moisture available to any of these storms and coverage of these storms look both to be greater on Monday. So the chances of exceeding a half inch of rain are higher on that day. While half inch of rain on 24 hours is not normally something that would be concerning, it is quite possible that a location were to realize such precipitation total, it would fall in an hour or less from a single thunderstorm. And that could cause flash flooding or debris flow concerns with burn scars from this year's or past, past few years. Thus, you can think of any heavy rainfall potential on Sunday and Monday as a low probability scenario that would have a high impact if it were to come to fruition. Stay tuned for updates in the coming days on this heavy rainfall potential. Here's a summary of expected weather events and impacts over the next week. If you have any questions, please don't hesitate to call or email the office. Have a great day.